Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, first of all, let's go to layer and new. Let's create new knowledge for camera movements. Select new and for move the anchor point center. Hold control, double click and behind icon. Clusation tool and select all of them layers without sky and background let's link to null object select null let's see okay so for now let's hide null object and select hand layer go to solo and let's move the up let's go to puppet pin tool let's add one puppet here one here and let's one here clusation tool go to window Open Duke Angela. If you have not Duke Angela, I will add link on the description below. Let's open. So let's click this icon and select this puppet effect here or here and go to, as you can see here, add pins. Let's click and click ignore. So we have puppet pins. Let's see. Okay, and let's create IQ system. Select Puppet Pin 3, link to Puppet Pin 2, select Puppet Pin 2, link to Puppet Pin 1. And select 3 puppets. Let's go to Do You Can Angela and click Auto Rig. Click Ignore. Okay, we have new controller. Select this controller, let's see. Okay, very nice. And go to Icon, change icon size like this for easy control. Let's unsolo these layers and select hand layer, puppets and controller. Let's move to down. Let's select this puppet pin 1. Let's link to hand layer, select hand layer. Let's see. Okay, also select controller, link to hand layer, select hand layer. Let's see. Okay, and controller, let's see. Okay, it works. So, select hand layer and let's move to down and let's press p let's create new person keyframe and go to 10 keyframes for shortcut you can use hold she press page down in keyboard and let's move to like this select keyframes make it easy let's see okay select last keyframe move to right and go to graphiator select these graphs let's make smooth animation back to two frames and in this time let's select this controller and let's press p let's create new pass in two frame go to 10 two frames and move to back let's move to like this for fix this problem let's go to do you kindly and let's change side 100 and let's see okay it works and Let's move it up like this. Let's move to here. Let's see. Okay. And go to again 10 Q frames for click animation. Like this. Select Q frames, make it easy. Let's see. Okay, so go to graph editor. Let's see. Okay, select this middle keyframe, move to left and move to right. Okay, back to keyframes. And for add bounce animation, go to three keyframes. For go to frame by frame, you can press page down in keyboard. One, two, three. And let's select this controller and move to like this. Again, three keyframes. One, two, three. Select this keyframe, copy pass for bounce animation let's see okay so select last two frames hold alt move to right and select all of them two frames right mouse go to two frame interpolation change current settings to linear click ok okay that's good and go to this middle two frame and let's move to a bloody bit and let's say again okay so in this time go to 5 keyframes and let's create hand keyframe 
go to again here and move it down so select this pin layer go to solo and anchor point move it down equalization tool and we can close do you can the window and go to window open animation comes to three again if you have not animation comes to three i can add link on the session below you can check now let's open starter presets to the layer and overshot scale from anchor point click in and move right for now select this pin and move to right this mark for slow animation and move to here let's see timing let's unsolo and I want to perfect timing here and let's move to like this and move to here this let's see okay that's good in this time let's go to first second select this land layer press s change scale zero create new scale two frame and go to five two frame change 100 and make it easy as two frames and select this white layer press s and click this icon change scales zero and let's create scale two frame go to next two frame change 100 let's go to solo select two frames make it easy go to graph editor and make smooth animations and this okay that's good we can use a little bit like this back to two frames and select purple let's go to solo and first second let's press s open scale click this icon and change scale zero create new scale two frame and go to next two frames change 100 and make two frames easy go to graph editor again let's do this for smooth animations back to two frames select last two frame move to right and select purple layer move to right okay let's unsolo these two layers okay and select land layer move to right select this hand layer puppet pins and controller move to right let's see let's move to left okay that's good and right now select this pin move to here okay nice and let's close two frame settings okay and let's enable airplane layer and phone layer okay and go to first second Let's select this phone layer, press P and move to down, create new pass in Q frame and go to here and move to up. Go to 10 Q frames, move to down again, 10 Q frame, move to up again, move to down and again, move to up. Select Q frames and make it easy. Okay, we have problem with less two frames. Select all of them two frames. Right mouse, two frame interpolation, change auto bezier to linear. Click OK. Okay, select these last five two frames. Move to left. Okay, that's good. So select these airplane and let's see. Let's move the inside here. And after click location like this, we can animate airplane. Select airplane, let's press P, create new passing Q frame. And go to fave Q frames and move to right like this. Select Q frames, make it easy. Let's see. Okay, go to graph editor and select this graph, make smooth animation. Okay, back to two frames. And let's go to back 
In this time, select this null, we can create camera movements animations. Let's press P, create new pattern keyframe. And go to here. Let's move to left. Like this. Select airplane. Move to center. Okay, let's see. So, select keyframes for camera and make it easy. Go to graph editor and select this graph, make smooth animation. Okay, let's make more smooth. Back to keyframes and select these keyframes, move to right. I want to more smooth and slow animation. Okay, that's good. And in this time, let's close settings. And select these layer clouds. Let's unsolo and move to here. Okay, we can select again clouds, right mouse and pre-compose, add name clouds. Click OK. Let's open composition. Select these clouds and move to center. And let's move to down like this and this here. Back to main composition and let's link to conversation to null object let's see okay and move to here this conversation in this time let's go to fs presses search effect tile select cc repeat tile let's use for clouds and in this time select these clouds move to here let's see let's move to right a little bit right Okay, and right now, let's select these clouds and press P. Go to here and create new passing keyframe. Go to 7 seconds and move to left. And go to CC Repetile, select Expand Right and change Expand like this. Let's see. Okay, let's see again. So, I want to more speedily, select these clouds, keyframe and select last position keyframe, move to left and change expand right for more. Okay, that's good. And open clouds, let's go to FS Presser, search epic wiggle, select wiggle position used for clouds. Okay, and for this, for this, and for this cloud. Let's see. Nice. So, in this time, let's select this wiggle position. Also use for this airplane. For wiggle. Nice, very good. So guys, in this time, let's select this airplane and go to layer, new and solid layer. Add name mask, change color black, click OK. And let's change size. Okay, select airplane. And if you not see this part, you can click toggle switch modes. And go to none, select alpha inverted matte mask. And let's see. Okay, so select mask and change size. Also, don't forget to select mask link to null object. And let's move to left this mask solid layer. Let's see. Okay, let's move to left more. Okay, right now we can't see here airplane parts. Nice. And let's select these layer plans. Let's move to up and move the anchor point down. Clization tool and these plants move to down and this move to down. And let's like this put here and this. Let's add expression for loop animation. Select plants, press R, open rotation. And let's hold Alt, click rotation. And right here we go. One nine. Let's see. Okay, that's good. And let's edit here and copy wiggle expression. 
Select Plan 2, Hold Alt, click Time icon, Ctrl V for pets. OK, and Plan 3, Hold Alt, click here, Ctrl V. OK, that's good. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.